Hi, my name is Meg Fleming and this is Paola Zakimi. And we created the book, Here Comes Ocean, together. And we just met for the first time about three minutes ago. So we're really excited that you're joining us today because we are thrilled to be taking you on a trip to the beach. Everybody needs a little vacation right now. And so we're going to take you on a trip by book to the beach. And, um, and let's see, Paula is, oh, I guess I should clarify. So Here Comes Ocean is a book we made together from yes. away from each other. So, okay, okay so Paula <laughs> is here and okay. I am here. And so we're meeting here together by Zoom to share our book with you. And Paula is the illustrator. So Paula, do you want to say hi? Hi, everybody. Well, my name is Paola Sakimi. I am from Argentina, and I am the illustrator of Here Comes Ocean. I will be speaking in Spanish, too. Okay, so, mi nombre es Paola Sakimi, y soy la ilustradora de Here Comes Ocean, que es, la traducción sería, aquí viene el océano, ¿no? O aquí viene océano, en realidad, Here Comes Ocean, aquí viene océano. <laughs> Thank you, Paula. <laughs> You're welcome, my love. <laughs> so it's really special because we've never met each other, and when you're working on a, something as fun as a picture book, um, you're doing it from far away. Even if you live close together, the illustrator and the author don't get to talk to each other or meet usually until after. But I don't know if we would have met for a long time unless I come down by you. So, so which I have to do. Um, so, but this is really special and exciting. So just to let you know a little bit about what we're going to do today, uh, we're going to share uh, our book and we're going to read part of it. We're not going to read all of it, but I'll be reading the text and Paula's going to be um, summing it up in Spanish so that we can see, um, we can share the story in multiple languages and then we're going to do lots of crafts. So I don't know if you see behind me. I have a, um, Paula designed beautiful cutouts, beautiful, um, a beautiful activity kit that we worked on together. And I want to make sure that you're able to find it before we get started. So this is, these are the websites where you can, let me see if that's good. Can you see that? Okay. Yes. Yes. Uh, okay. I will say this in Spanish too. Okay. Oh yes. Yeah, say, say it in Spanish. Yes. Meg and I. Meg y yo hicimos un pequeño librito de actividades que va junto con el libro y ustedes lo pueden descargar en las direcciones que ven en la pantalla, ¿sí? Ok. Ok, thank you. So before we get started on our, our story and our song and our crafts, we want to thank the Bay Area Book Fest for yeah. having us here. It is so... It is so great to be here and be together and be sharing via Zoom our adventures. And so thank you so much for having us. We also want to thank um, Simon & Schuster and Beach Lane Books, our gals there who helped us create this beautiful book, and our amazing agent, Emily Van Beek. Yes. And so we love all of you, and we're so glad to be here. So let's go to the beach. So to travel to the beach, we're going to use music. And so we're going to sing a little um, ocean song. So here's the challenge though, because I like to rhyme and I often, when I'm singing songs, I forget what part I'm at. And so Paula is going to yell out, we're going to sing down by the bay to get the, to the beach. So it's sort of like we're getting in a car by singing and we're going to the beach. Okay. And then Paula is going to yell out or not yell, you can yell, but she's going to sh shout out a ocean creature it can be anything and i'm going to try my best to rhyme it and it can okay. even, it can even be in spanish and i'll just do my best <laughs> <We'll see. laughs> i am ready so we're in the car we're on our way to the ocean let's get yeah you drive you drive okay. i'll say down by the bay watermelons grow back to my home 
I dare not go, for if I do, my mother will say, did you ever see a seagull, seagull, <laughs> with a beagle, down by the bay, down by the bay, where the watermelons grow, back to my home. If I do, if I do, if I do, my mother will say, what's she gonna, gonna say? Did you ever see a crab? Crab! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> a kebab down by the bay, down by the bay. The watermelon grow back to my home. I dare not go, or if I do, my mother will What's she gonna gonna say? <laughs> Did you ever see a by the wind, sailor, sailor, here, look at Did you ever see <laughs> the light the wind sailor? No, no, this is the comb jelly. Oh, that's the comb jelly. <laughs> <laughs> no matter, you see wherever you want, come on. <laughs> Did you ever see a by the wind sailor? Flying around on a hay baler <laughs> down by the bay. Down by the bay. Yay. Okay, we made it to the ocean. So I'm going to put my ukulele back and we are going to get the book out. Down by the bay. I will sing in all day that part. Down by the bay. All right. All day. I don't have the book, you know. Wait, you still don't have a copy? No, no, because of the quarantine. But don't matter, I have this proof. Okay. okay. So everybody, it's probably interesting to know that we've all, around the world, we've been inside. And we've all been quarantined and contained and trying to keep each other safe from, um, from the um, coronavirus. And... This is part of the reason why it's really special to be traveling by book and taking a trip to the beach together. Paula, I found out in the, I tried to mail her something and um, your mail, your mail system isn't open. So you're not even getting no. mail. No, 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 no front outside the country. So, so, um, so we're, um, so Paula doesn't have a book. Wait. I can't wait to get you your book. Do you want to? Do you want to segue in Spanish and let them know that we're going to start reading? Yes, of course. Well, eh, vamos a estar leyendo este li el libro que es Aquí viene Océano. Meg va a ser la parte en inglés y yo voy a contarles de qué se trata en español. ¿sí? Yo todavía no tengo el libro, está viajando mi libro, así que voy a usar el de prueba. ¿sí? Que después les voy a contar un poquito de qué se trata. Meg, you're going to start when you yes. want. Yeah, that's great. Okay, so here comes Ocean, written by me and illustrated by Paula Zucchini. Woohoo! <laughs> uh, these are, oh, Paula, at the end, maybe we can tell them all the cr critters too. Yes, okay. Uh, you can, you want to start? Yeah, I'll start and then you can, and I'll do, um, Two pages, and then you can do two pages. All right. Okay. Oh. Here comes Ocean. Sun Beach, Rise Beach, pale in hand, found a dollar in the sand. Cool those toes, what next? Who knows? Here comes Ocean. I'll hold it up. Okay. Oh, thank you. Bueno, acá el nene va a la playa con su mamá, su papá y su perro, ya llegó a la playa, ya se instalaron, hay una suave brisa, y va de paseo y se encuentra con un erizo, nosotros le decimos erizo, pero la traducción sería, aguardame un minuto, sería como erizo de dólar, y se sorprende porque ya encuentra su primer tesoro en la playa. Ok, second page. Uh, no, 
¿Yes? Yes. Ah, entonces eh, 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 se enfría, acá en, la, en esta parte el nene enfría los pies en la arena, que es cuando la arena se junta con el mar, entonces eh, siente el, el fresco del agua y pregunta, ¿qué va a pasar ahora? ¿Quién lo sabe? Acá viene océano, mientras el perrito va persiguiendo a las gaviotas y hay un amiguito que se está acercando detrás del balde. No sé si ustedes lo ven, pero yo lo veo. <risa> ¿Listo? <risa> Okay, you're wrong. Soft beach, warm beach, dig a seat. Something's nibbling on my feet. What's nibbling? A crab. A crab. <laughs> Hide those toes. What next? Who knows? Here comes ocean. Bueno, acá el nene está acabando, está haciendo, se está haciendo un asiento y está imitando un poco al perro, ¿no? A su perro que también está acabando. Y de repente siente algo en el pie. ¿Y qué ve en el pie? Un cangrejito. Entonces, ¿qué hace? Agarra el cangrejito, lo, va, lo pone adentro de su baldecito y se pregunta, ¿qué pasa ahora? ¿Quién lo sabe? Aquí viene océano. Here comes ocean. I love this crab so much. <laughs> He's so curious. Salt beach, breeze beach, look a track. Pipers chase the water back. Sink those toes, what next? Who knows? Here comes ocean. Well, here, acá está, veo unos pájaros en, el, en, el, en la playa, y estos pájaros se llaman andarrios, creo, tengo que traducirlo así porque yo no los conozco, nunca vi un andarrio de cerca. You know, sandpiper, I never saw a sandpiper in my life. Uh, because we have another kind of sea here. So, eh, el nene ve los pajaritos y mira que hay unas huellas. Ve como los pajaritos se van al océano, se van hacia el océano, y damos vuelta a la página, ah, ok. Ah, los pies se le hunden en la arena, mientras se pregunta qué va a pasar después, ve una pluma. ¡Acá viene el océano! Y miren quién está por ahí escondido. ¿Quién está ahí escondido mirando desde el balde? El señor cangrejo. Mr. Crab is there. Hi. Mr. Crab, he's everywhere and he's so fun to find. <laughs> so we're going to jump ahead to the end. So it gets it goes out through the over the course of the day at the beach. And Paula, I just love your illustrations so much. It is such a honor to have words my words so well considered and beautifully oh, illustrated oh don't say that it's well i favorite. have to say that <laughs> <laughs> i love the book i i read the book and i love it i really love it truly truly well you've made it a hundred thousand times more beautiful so oh thank you well so we just are going to gush over each other in between <laughs> Uh, so it goes through the whole day at the beach, and then we get to the end, where you know what happens when the day starts to end. So here's going to be the ending. Oh, moon yeah. beach, night beach, well, sorry, moon beach, night beach, sparkly swish, wish upon a nightlight fish. Snug those toes, what next? You know. Night, night, ocean. Esta parte del, del libro, el nene ya pasó todo su día en la playa y ahora ya llega la noche y ve sobre el mar unas luces que son los peces de la luz, algo así, serían como unas algas que tienen como luces, yo no sé el nombre específico de este pez. Eh, y eh, ya está muy cansado el nene porque corrió todo el día por la playa y ya está con su papá, a UPA, y se, se sigue preguntando, ¿y ahora qué pasa? Vos lo sabés, dice, buenas noches, océano, y ahí está Pino. Hey. I love the ending. 
So I was going to say one thing. These nightlight fish, so at the yes. end you can see Paula has named all of the critters, and they're oh, yes. comb, comb jellies, and they are bioluminescence, and at nighttime it causes um, these, they're like jellyfish, but it causes them to glow in the dark. And so really you can wish upon a nightlight fish, which I think is super cool. Yes. So Paula, why don't we go ahead and do some activities? All right, yeah. I'm ready. Okay. And we might not have time to completely do all of them, but we can definitely talk through all of them. So, okay, before we share our activity kit, Paula has a video that we're gonna plug in here so that you can see her process. And it's so beautiful and it's really fun to see how she created all the uh, illustrations for this book. Paula? Okay, I, uh, lo voy a decir en español. Entonces, eh, hice un, un, a ver el nombre lo quiero decir bien, una medusa peine sería la traducción. Es una medusa que brilla en la oscuridad, ¿sí? Hice todo el proceso de pintura que lo van a ver ahora en un ratito en un video. ¿Ok? Awesome. Okay, so we're going to move on to, um, we mentioned earlier the activity kit. We want to make sure that maybe they can put up these addresses so that we get um, yes. those on there. So we're going to start with the Beach Boy and Paper Doll. All right. I Oh, I want to make the, the crab doll. Okay, uh, do the crab. Do the crab. Okay. Because okay. you made a big, you made a big crab, so yes. In the libro de actividades, in the activity book, can, you, you can show, you will find the crab doll. In the libro de actividades, ustedes van a encontrar el cangrejito, que es una muñeca de papel. Yo lo tengo ya recortado y listo para armarlo junto con ustedes. I will assembly the crab. Do you? What do you think? Yeah, right. I, yeah. I, go ahead and start putting it together, and while you're putting it together, I'll say what you just said in English. All right, right. Paula's going to show how to make this crab, and you can find it in our activity kit, which we mentioned earlier. It's um, you need some um, paper to print it out on. I use cardstock because it's thicker, yes. uh, so it's easier to use. And then look at I have a little bowl of brads. Yes. You can use that or you can use where are, I don't have it here. Sorry. Um, go on, go on. So, um, so what you're going to do is you're going to cut out your crab, right? Oh, and look, Paula's got, she's got, and then you punch the holes in the, she has indicated where the holes are. So you punch the holes in. Look at that beauty. <laughs> and then um, assemble together. And I have one somewhere. Where's my crab? Oh. Oh, this is so fun. Where's my crab? He goes to the beach. He went to the beach. He went <laughs> okay. to the beach. <laughs> well, well, you're talking about the crab. So I made a crab too. I don't know where he went. But this is the boy. And so when you put your, um, when you have made your crab and your paper boy, Oh, I like calling it a paper boy because of a paper boy. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so, All right. But you can take your crab and your boy on adventures in your book. So you can make up, you can stand your book up and say, let's go say hi, let's go pick up a shell. And there you have a shell. And, and you make that noise. You have to make that noise, no? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Tell them in Spanish, Paula. 
Ok. Ah, cuando tengan hechas las muñecas de papel, ustedes pueden, junto con el libro, por ejemplo, el nene, que está hecho de papel, puede ir y pueden jugar, agarrar eh, la concha de mar, la pluma, y hacen el sonidito. Ui, ui, y agarran la pluma y agarran del samper. Ah, el andarrio, el andarrio. Ok. Ok. <risa> Okay, so um, that was great. <laughs> I love the new one. I'm sorry. I, I, I am looking for something to punch here. You need to make holes. Remember that. Okay, here. Paula, you can use mine. Here you go. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, yes. it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. I thank you. Okay, well, you're going to, well, you're, oh, there you go. Yes, I Look almost it. done. I recycle a paper. You see, I have a paper. I make a test of the crab. And now here it is. Hello, Meg. Hello. Meg. Hello. Hello, I am Mr. Crab. Mm. Hello. Oh, okay, like this. I Hi, the, the Mr. Is, oh, hello, my friend. <laughs> Let's go to the beach. Together, New. we so much adventures. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. We might have to move quickly through our next activities because um, I know our friend Dora is, might be running out of time. Okay. Okay. So, so the, 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 we can make the last one, the... Sand pail? Yeah. Yeah. What? Okay. Do you like that? I like that. Because I made my friend. Look at how pretty your is. Beautiful. Look at this. That's okay. So beautiful. I put my name there. Ustedes pueden poner su nombre y la pueden decorar. Yo la imprimí en color. What, what is yours? yours? Okay, so mine is not decorated as, as nicely, but one of the things I did is um, I use yarn. You can, you can, piece it together. Hang on, I want to show them first what it looks like. So you have all the materials there. You are so good. So you're going to put them together and then um, you can use yarn or glue or a stapler to piece them together. And yes. then we have these that you're going to cut out. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you have everything ready. Look, I Cut out my animals. Yes, my yes animals. And then when you're going to the beach, along with the story, the first beach is Sun, Sun Beach Rise Beach, um, pail in hand, found a dollar in the sand. You can I found find... it. Yes. Yeah. Paula, will you translate that? Yes, I encontré un erizo en la arena, un erizo seco en la arena que se llama erizo dólar y que no se ve porque mi luz es muy fuerte, pero ustedes lo van a ver. Ahí, ¿lo ven? Ahí lo ven. Ahí está. Ah, yes, yes, thank you. Entonces lo vamos a guardar en la... en el balde. And then we can go hunting for treasures on the beach. Yes. And our houses, which is nice. You have... And then... A sea star. Oh, go ahead, go, go ahead, Paula. Una estrella de mar encontramos. A lo largo del libro ustedes van a leer y van a encontrar diferentes objetos, diferentes tesoros. Uno de los tesoros es la estrella de mar, que me tiene y la van guardando en su baldecito. ¿Sí? All right. And then we have... <laughs> I'm lost. No, that's good. I think we can go straight from this to the um, mobile. Oh, I don't, I don't, uh, 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 uh. That's okay. So, it's okay. Okay, so the mobile is, you can take the same um, ocean treasures that we use for our sand hunt, and you can, we can make them into a mobile. Oh, um, Paula, do you want to say that while I bring yes. and show this? Yes. Todos los animales y todos los tesoros que encontramos en el libro y los, los recortamos, podemos hacer un móvil como el que nos está mostrando Meg, ¿sí? Y van a ver que cada 
tesoro tiene un puntito negro que ustedes lo van a agujerear y a través de él van a pasar un hilo y lo pueden colgar en palitos, en una percha, en un alambrecito, ¿eh? le pueden agregar caracoles de verdad, todo lo que ustedes quieran. Ok. Thank you. So you can see that you, you're going to put the um, mobile together using the same critters that we have. <laughs> My screen is crooked and I'm throwing things. <laughs> using the critters we have for the ocean treasure hunt. And, um, whoa, I almost fell. You can use a hanger or you can use sticks and wrap the yarn around. Like a spider web? Yeah. Do you want to say that, Paula? Sticks or hands? Ah, or podemos, bueno, ves, con dos palitos, como tiene me, en cruz, con un hilito, lo vamos haciendo todo alrededor y podemos colgar los, los, los tesoros de ahí, con un hilito, perfecto, ahí nos está mostrando me, perfecto, genial. Good. <laughs> okay. So we've got the mobile, we've got the ocean, the treasure hunt, we got the paper boy and the crab doll. And also in the kit, in the activity kit, is um, you'll find some fun word games. Oh. There's, I shouldn't have, I double. I accidentally printed double. So this is a word search, and you're going to be hunting for our, um, for our critters and the, that you'll find in the back of the book. Paula, do you yeah. want to en, en el kit de actividades van a ver que van a tener como una sopa de letras, en donde ustedes van a encontrar en esa sopa de letras palabras que eh, son los nombres de los tesoros que encontramos durante todo el libro, ¿no? Por ejemplo, eh, crab, cangrejo, entonces van a buscarlo en inglés, por supuesto van a buscar las palabras, y las van a ir a encontrar. Ay, yeah. Thank okay. you. And then also is the... Um, crossword puzzle and um, that also uses all of the our critters from our book and there's little rhymes down here like I look like a prize I have no joints I live in the ocean I have five points I know what it is what is it star star I lose my star my star there we go starfish for the wind, so then we would plug in our starfish. So it's an immersive experience, this activity kit. <laughs> you can sing, you can act, you can dance. <laughs> it's all the things. So, um, Paula, we might have time for a, one closing question. Um, do you do you have any? No, no? we don't. Uh, no, no. no, we don't. Okay, so how about we just um, we'll just say thank you so much for joining us today, and we're excited to see. Oh, you can um, you can make your projects and hashtag it here comes. Oh yes, because we want to see what you're making. We want to see your mobiles, and we want to see your activity kits. And, or your um, your sand pails and how you make them yourself. Paula, can you share that? Yes. Nos encantaría que compartan con nosotras las actividades que hacen del libro con el hashtag. Hashtag. Here comes ocean. Here comes ocean. The same oh, name okay. of the book. Yes. Yeah. All right. So we love you all, and we hope that you enjoyed this little trip to the beach. We hope that you will um, print out our activity and do some sand, go on a seashore hunt and find some treasures. And Paula, it is such a treat to meet you. I just adore you and um, it's, a, it's an honor to meet you. Ah, estoy muy feliz yo también de haberte conocido, de por fin habernos visto. Lo estoy diciendo todo en español porque Meg entiende absolutamente todo lo que estoy diciendo. Estamos muy contentas de estar acá, les agradecemos a todos por estar y esperamos que realmente hagan las actividades del kit que son muy, muy divertidas. ¿Sí? Nos vemos por allí, por la web. <risa> bye, bye. Bye, thank you.